what I just said. We may feel the need to keep the flame burning or the fire lit by allowing our significant others to revisit, you know, times that, you know, refresh them. Because we don't want to dry them out and make them bored and don't feel like we didn't put the ball and chain on them and lock them up. Okay. okay. So what we do is we, we give them permission slips with a pass and say, you can go out with your boys of yesteryear every other weekend. You gotta have a man's night out, a boy's night out. Every other weekend, or once a month. And with that, I go with my guys to where I had no business going. <clears throat> I'm in atmospheres, I have no business being. <clears throat> I'm at stripper joints. Oh Lord. I'm at clubs I used to hang out with. You in the club? Yeah, in the club like us. <laughs> Make a love in the club? No, I can if I don't. Because <laughs> I got no business being there. <laughs> because there are rules and regulations to, what? to the game. There it is. So I'm going to pause right there. Permission slip. A wife will say, yeah, honey. Yeah, babe. Yeah, boo. Whatever you want to call this cat, this brother, this fella. And you allow him to go back with the pass. And he goes back into where he used to be before he met you, which he called his fulfillment. So with that taking place, it can end up in a serious violation that may result in a disqualification. So let me ask yourself, homeboy, why is that? Let's just let's just lay down some facts. Get sticky. Let's tell the truth. The truth is What's the truth, brother? Give us the truth. There's a reason why the scripture says when you come to a because marriage is supposed to be a new venture, a new place, a new season. Why are you taking old wineskins? Mmm, I like that. Old mindsets. I like that. I like that. Old situations into a new venture. Wow. When we get give our life to the Lord, I, I, we, this is a scripture, but I think it's principle. He said, anyone that's in this new place is a new creature. Former things are passed away. Because when I was in the strip club, I was trying to make love. Come on here. In the in club. club. Every day was Halloween because I was tricking and, and treating. All right, all right. So there's a thing called familiar spirits. Mm, we're going to get deep. Uh, certain songs, I like all music, all kind of music. Yeah, I love it. I'm Radio Raheem, brother. But certain songs love, hate. trigger certain events. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Because when Martin Luther King died, I think of uh, Marvin Gaye. Mm -hmm. What's going on? And I like that, too. I do, too. When I heard it, when I heard it, I'm always connected to that song. Right. So certain songs in the club. Mm -hmm. When I was kicking it. Mm -hmm. When I was doing things like I've been doing. Man, I've been doing. Mm -hmm. It brings me all. It, music atmospheres bring you all the way back to that place. Yeah, because it plays on our minds. It plays on our minds. Things. Come on, man. That's what it does. And then it takes you to certain mindsets. That's right, that's right. I don't need to go back to a single man's mindset when mm. I'm married. Oh, that's a myth. I use that. Come on, man. If I go back to a single man's mindset Mentality. when I'm married, I am prompt. I am tempted. I'm enticed to do the things that I did when I wasn't married. Wow, wow, wow. The scripture wow. says you don't get no place to the devil. You told me the devil was a Komodo. Yeah, Komodo, brother. <laughs> What did Komodo do to you? Devour. <laughs> mm. Why you still breathing? Why you he, dead or not? He don't stop till he get enough. It's just that simple. Come on, man. Devour you. So let me ask you this, brother. Since you building that strong point now, I pass the mic back. All right. Uh, let me go Bible on you. All right. All right. Uh, can a man take fire into his bosom and not be burned? Can he do it? No. <laughs> what kind of no is that? <laughs> no, no, no is no in Chinese. <laughs> no is no in Australian. <laughs> no is no in Dutch. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, can a man walk upon high coals 
and not be burned. His feet not be burned? No. <laughs> <laughs> so, 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 those are scriptures in Proverbs. Come on, man. So, let me bring it down out of script then, so everybody can relate in case you don't know the script. We'll come all the way down. Can you play with fire and not be burned? No. So, with that being said, if I can't play with fire and not be burned, why do my wife sign my permission slip for me to go play with fire? do something that's going to burn our relationship up. It's called the cost of compromise. compromise. I like that. Talk back. Because I said, if you're going to be in a relationship, those things are supposed to be passed away. Mm -hmm. We talked about what is the makeup, what qualifies a man. Mm -hmm. A man that put away those things. Mm -hmm. A man, he said, you said, Paul said, when I was a child, That's right. when I was a young man that was undisciplined and saw my old wall oats, I did those things. Right. When I became a man, I put, I put away. away those things. Mm -hmm. That's you wanting something that's not qualified. Ooh -wee. Mm. That's that's bootlegging. That's bootlegging. Come that's on. selling liquor with no license. Mm, with no license. That's a bootleg. Okay. Wow. Trying to make wrong right. right. What does fire do? Fire burns. It consummates. It'll burn your flesh. It will be. The Bible yeah. talks about it'll burn your conscience. The first time I'm just doing it with my boys. We just kicking it, mm -hmm. having little drinks and all that. Mm -hmm. And the man, uh, 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 what the dancer name? Secret Desire. Secret mm -hmm. Desire. I was really looking at you, boys. Really looking at you. Mm. And, and, and the first time. Did it, but now that's that that moment, those events, mm -hmm. those images that you seen, Kodak moment, those Kodak moments, they're staying in your mind and yeah. start building momentum. It's like, the next time, next weekend, let's go again, let's go again. And, let's go, and you build up this this momentum or this climax to you actually. The Bible says, when when lust conceiveth, uh oh, it's pregnant now, brother. For anything to conceive, there has to be yeah. submission. Mm -hmm. There has to be a seed and an egg, mm -hmm. and, and, and there has to be. Uh, 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 a consummation. A consummation. That took place. That you yield to lust. Mm -hmm. That it birth sin. When lust conceive it, it birth it, it it consummates or starts sin. And when sin goes through its process, process. it brings trimester. Mm -hmm. It births death. Mm. Death is a physical or a spiritual separation. A spiritual separation <laughs> can be you lose interest in your life. <coughs> You lose love and honoring and cherishing your wife. You begin to desire these lustful things, then honorable things. And before you, you get comfortable dancing in the fire, dancing with the devil, mm. until you bring home something that penicillin don't fix. Mm. What, well, we get into that later. Uh, uh, bring home an STD. Mm -hmm. Bring home a baby. Mm -hmm. Oh, you get so freaky because all these we're at a time now where folks are, they they went to bed a man woke up in the, in the morning as a woman mm -hmm. they want to change their gender and all that because you mm -hmm. because you got introduced to something that got you lost in turned out permission slip permission slip hall passes hall passes passports passports Walker. When I was a kid in grade school, uh -huh. we had all type of events, brother. But what those events were called was field trips. Yes, sir. And a field trip was something that you look forward to going to. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Because it was such a major event, brother. Something new. Something new. Possibly never been there before. Never been there before. Experimental, lavish. Fun. Oh man, you could just brainstorm Class is going. Class is going. Partners going. Partners going. We got the sack lunches. <laughs> you leaving the school. Yeah. No more teachers, no more books. Come on, come on. We going on a field trip. But before I could go to the field trip, Elder Walker, come on. That was giving me a paper. A piece of paper. Mm -hmm. And I was supposed to take this paper home. To my parents. To my parents. And it was called a permission slip. <laughs> so in order for me to have this good time, you needed permission. I needed permission. From the authorities that was over your life. Right, and they were supposed to do what that paper? They supposed to sign it. There it is. And give permission, permission. 
for Elder Williams to do what? To go. There it is. So with they signed it. It's been authorized. It's been permitted. It's been permitted. I can give it back to the teacher and I can go. Yes, sir. It was the permission slip that granted me to get into this atmosphere. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That was beyond that. Yes, sir. Brother, we went to places like Kaleidoscope. <laughs> Couldn't tell me nothing about Kaleidoscope. Museums. 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 Zoos. Zoos. Uh, uh, where else we go? We would uh, go to the farm. The farm. We would take a field trip just to tour and look. We go on a field trip. We anticipated it. But in order for me to engage in those events, I have to have my permission slip signed. So, in a violation of marriage, Brothers, permission slips women. Mm -hmm. You are signing a permission slip for your husband to go on a field trip. Okay. Continually in the marriage. We know what field trips do to us. Yes, sir. So if you continue to sign his permission slip that he brings you, you giving him permission to do what? To, to go out into the field. That is. So to enjoy yourself. So why would a woman in a marriage, brother, or a man, or a man, woman or a man, girls night out, girls trip, whatever, fellas night out, we can't, woo, why would you sign that permission slip? Several reasons. Son, we talked about the cost of compromise, because you know he gonna, what happens if he say no? He gonna go anyway. He gonna go anyway. So that you don't have no conflict, you give him permission to do what you know in your heart he would already do. Mm. And so that's the cost of compromise. Then you got folk who give hall passes, mm -hmm. permission slips, mm -hmm. passports mm -hmm. for the love of money. Whoa, watch that, whoa. Ain't nobody hiring all that, you know, man, your wife all built and everything, and you know, she used to strip. Mm. Our back is against the wall. We need to pay these bills. I'm only in there stripping because we got we gotta get this money. Mm. Or maybe that's maybe that's too facetious. Okay. Maybe she's an actress. Okay, let's go there. Okay, we can go there. She's an actress. They got this script. We thought she was perfect for the script. We're gonna bring in uh, Denzel Walker. <laughs> <laughs> and it's gonna be this, uh, this wonderful script. We just got a few scenes, <laughs> you know. Say because in, in the script, y'all y'all a married couple, y'all y'all your long lost lovers. Mm -hmm. So in the screen, you know. Yeah, you know, you're gonna take off and you're gonna have this little love scene, but it's not really make love. You know, you're gonna just expose your breasts and all this okay now. But you're gonna do that. Well, baby, um, they got me in the script. They got me in the script. And they talking about six digits. Mm -hmm. We better do such, 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 such. But the only, only kickback is I gotta take my shirt off mm -hmm. and I gotta make a love scene. Okay. We ain't making love, mm -hmm. but I gotta make this I gotta love make scene. make a love scene, though. You get this how, 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 how much money was this? How many, six digits? You know, uh, mm -hmm. You know, usually I wouldn't do that, but you know, we you know we need to get this money, got to pay these taxes and everything. So, 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 so go ahead and do it because you know you're a professional. So you're a professional. This is your profession. You actress, and you give them permission to violate a holy consummation, a holy contract, a holy covenant for the love of money. Mm, mm, mm. What, what was your girl? <coughs> uh, Nisi. Nisi uh, Nash. Is it Nisi Nash? Yeah, show up. She had that show. That was my girl. She had that. Now, she played uh, in that one movie, The Cleaner, with uh, Cedric the Entertainer. It was a movie called The Cleaner. She was, she was nice, played a little thing. After that, I think she got a, I think she got a booze done because she did this show called Claws mm -hmm. where they done jumped two, three sizes, and every time they showed a commercial, all you see was... was Claws and bras. Claws and bras. Hollywood had set her up. Set her up greatly because she was the ultimate fulfillment to a man's eye. Come on. Nisi was eye candy. And she was married. And she was married. Her husband get in was there. an engineer. Get in there, bro. Electrical engineer, if I'm not mistaken. Because y'all, we keep it sticky. We keep it funky. Hey. We don't throw rocks, we don't chunk rocks. We kick ballistics and facts. So we gonna talk about mm -hmm. everything because you know why? Because there are rules and regulations, regulations to, to the, the game. game. Ain't nobody, and, 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 and in the Old Testament, their lives was an example for the people mm -hmm. 
in the New Testament, all the people mm -hmm. that was their lives was documented mm -hmm. to be our examples. And I don't know why wish no demise on nobody, but the fact of the matter the is, of the matter is, people go to certain arenas and they get lost and turned out. Hollywood ain't what you thought. Hollywood, mm -hmm. they became Hollywood, Hollywood swingers. Already, Hollywood has no respect, none for vows for marriage. As a matter of fact. When they put these shows together, they always make the husband some 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 dummy, mm -hmm. some dope, some chump. They promote some abuse, swinging. Yes. They promote the 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 the, the, uh, the dude that sleep with everybody. Mm -hmm. They promote the hot chick and all mm -hmm. that. This is what they promote on the media mm -hmm. and movies and sitcoms. Mm -hmm. And they'll go to a beautiful couple and say, "Man, your woman is fine. Mm -hmm. We want to get her in this scene." Mm -hmm. For you to be the number one stunt, for you to be the top actress uh, in Hollywood, you need to do this. For you to be the top actor, mm -hmm. you not no act, even action. We need you to do this, and they bring these compromises. What we call, what God considers flags. That's right. Violation. Violation. Crossing the line of scrimmage. Crossing the line of scrimmage. You if you can't play with fire. You told the scriptures that if you play with fire, you're gonna get burned. You're gonna get burned. There's no way around it, brother. Some burns you can't recover from. Some burns you can't recover from. Permission slip. If I don't let him or let her have a fun, because I don't want her up under me all the time, mm -hmm. and she don't want me up under her all the time. You know, we, we, we want to give each other space. I mean, have your space and have my space. You, you go out with the girls and y'all have girls, tripping girl night out. Uh, me and the fellas gonna go back and we gonna kick it. Permission slip. Uh -huh. That permission slip, if you're not careful, if your permission slip signing is allowing your significant other to go on a field, field trip, if you can, the field trip consists of violations of fire to your marriage, you saying what he could bring home or what she could bring back home from the field trip. Uh oh, bro. Well, it's not always a physical thing. It could be a spiritual thing. I think a Tyler Tyler Perry movie. I think it was a family that prays. I love that. That's that, that only one of the ones I talked up to that. Because yeah. he 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 don't he don't help us men. We always the cheater, the abuser, or, mm -hmm. or the, the punk. Or we, punk. Yeah, we that dude. It was um. Uh, the brother, he's mm -hmm. a good, he worked a structure job, mm -hmm. had the wife that was an accountant or something, mm -hmm. a big firm. Mm -hmm. It's an Yeah, love, love hip-hop, love of basketball. Love of basketball. Uh, she got exposed mm. to an environment that began to change her mentality. Uh -oh. And she brought a spirit home. A spirit home, brother. That, that maybe it was already in her or whatever, but it was brought out when she got to a certain environment. Mm -hmm. She got despising her husband, top cold. She got to give her the reference. Please listen to these rules to the game. Mm -hmm. Never, ever, mm -hmm. ever use another man as a point of reference ahead, to prosperity, what it is to be solid, what is the word operating authority. We have a manual mm -hmm. <laughs> that you go by. If you use somebody as an example, you ain't got the word. You're gonna have trouble mm -hmm. in the nest. If you <coughs> use this is what they do in the church. Mm -hmm. Wish you study the Bible like pastor. Uh oh, we talked about that one. Wish you wish you take care of business like uh, uh, brother Jameson. Wish you dress like brother James. <coughs> brother, that's going to be conflict. That's going. That was a flags. Those are transgressions in communication and deal with one another, and it's going to bring. Problems. There you go. In the movie, she got exposed to the wrong environment. She got to disrespect her husband. Violations. Uh, she got to make comparisons. Mm -hmm. Eventually, she started sleeping with the dude. Wow. Violation. She got to sleeping with the dude, and she thought she was winning being the other chick. Wow, bro. Got exposed to the wrong environment, and that type of exposure. And and, and and I'm not gonna put it all on her. Right, right, right. Because he he playing dumb. You seen she start changing, being around all that. Instead of you taking dominion and control of your marriage, the, mm. what you had to do, he gave it a pass. Now we talking about past. 
He gave it a pass. Gave it a pass. They didn't last. They didn't last. Because the permission slips yep. had built up. Plus, she was making that money. There, she was making that money. He was he was doing construction, but he yeah. wasn't making what she was making. And you gave her, you know, you know, it's her job and everything. And I think it was Tyler Perry telling, "Hey man, you what about this?" He went to the bank and found all this money in the bank. So he gonna say, ah, "All passes, I don't know. Yeah. I'll check and everything." He say, "Hey, and don't tell nobody." He went and told the sister all the business. Long story short, it's because you gave a pass. You didn't last. It didn't last. Mm-hmm. Let me piggyback. Mm-hmm. He ignored. Mm. He go ahead, William. <laughs> Come on, William. He continually ignored from the sideline. <laughs> flags on the field. <laughs> he ignored <laughs> the flags that was thrown. Um. On the field. <laughs> you cannot ignore. Come on, Doc. The flags that are thrown on, on the, the field. field. That will put you on the bench. <laughs> which will get you out of the game. game. You will lose ground and you will never win. You can never recover. You you are set back. Come on, man. Flags push you back. back. That's what flags do from your forward progress, puts you back. And because he was passive, yes, and counting the cost of compromise, yes. Now watch me now, Walt. I'm gonna go back to that piece of paper I pulled. Yes, the back. Well, that scripture we read says this here. Watch me, Walt. Husbands, First Peter three seven. Mm -hmm. So you know this is Bible and not these here. Mm -hmm. Husbands, we talking about him? Yeah, yeah move. Mm -hmm. In the same way, be considerate as you live with your wife. Come on, man. And treat them with respect as the weaker partner, as heirs with you. Gracious gift of life so that nothing will hinder your prayers. Some versions say, treat them according to the knowledge. knowledge. What you know. No. Oh, yes. I'm, I'm, I'm getting, getting here while we're going to get sticky. That's why I had to go back to the oh. source of scripture. According to see when you know your significant other, yeah, you can be like Keith Sweat and say something, 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 something. What? Just, just ain't right. You don't sit there and put all the bills on the table, sort them out, and add up stuff. Because <laughs> what I'm adding up and looking in these bills ain't what me and you make. <laughs> something ain't right. <laughs> I know your job. Yeah, and you know mine. Yeah. This here supersedes bonus. <laughs> Cause I know, Come on, man. according to knowledge of my wife, I know you. Now watch me walk up before I close out this thing. I'm gonna pass the mic to you. All right. Uh, but I'm gonna make. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go out the way for a minute. But I'm gonna cut across the field. Joseph had dreams as a boy. Mm -hmm. Had dreams. Carried out the wrong way. To fulfillment. The journey was still a dream, but it wasn't carried out the way he thought it. Yeah. So he ended up being thrown into a well, a sister. Mm -hmm. He ended up working for a head man called Potiphar. Mm -hmm. Faithful in his stewardship yes, and his servitude. Yes, sir. Potiphar honored him because the grace of God was on him. Favorite God was on him. Okay. Got into a situation mm -hmm. because that anointing on him was attractive. The anointing. Is attractive. Is attractive, Come on, brother. Man. A lion. Let me say that word, our friend Williams say. Whore. Mm -hmm. Accused him of rape. Yes, sir. Now watch me walk. Had he accepted the proposal, mm -hmm. she wouldn't have accused him of rape. Yes. He did not accept the violation of his relationship with Potiphar that would have violated mm -hmm. his relationship with his wife. Come on. So when the news got back that Joseph supposedly, let me use that word they used in Hollywood, allegedly, <laughs> yeah, they love that word, allegedly raped this sister, this chick. Potiphar said, hmm, now watch where I'm going with it. I'm coming back to the field, I'm coming back home with it, all right? 
Walker, I study, brother. But you don't hang with you, you got study. <laughs> I, I don't know. You, you can't hang with Walker and not study. You, you got study, brother. <laughs> Sister, whoever you is. Um, I study, Walk. It said Potiphar was a head man. He he was head of executioners. Mm-hmm. Executioners, brother. In other words, Potiphar had the passcode and the password to the guillotine. Mm-hmm. You couldn't use a guillotine unless you got a password from Potiphar. Come on. So anytime you violated something before Potiphar in the courts, Potiphar gave him the passcode, the password for that guillotine to draw on your neck. He had authority to have you executed. There it is. Where I'm going. To have you disqualified. Yes. But according to the scripture, Potiphar didn't disqualify or execute Joseph. You know why? Why? Because he knew his wife. wife. Come on, bro. Talk back. Come on, bro. He knew his wife. So he knew what type of spirit that was. Yes. And he knew what type of wife he had. Don't get in there. And he knew Joseph. And he, ooh, he understood that the favor of mm-hmm. God was on Joseph because everything he set his hand to do, Come on. it prospered. He knew no. his wife. He knew she was loose. He knew she was strange. Mm. She knew she was without borders. Come on here. Mm, mm, mm. And that that accusation yeah, that she presented mm. probably False. wasn't the first. Come on. Woo! Probably wasn't the first. I'm gonna go and say a little bit. It was most definitely not the first one. Come on. Your practice becomes your perfection. Talk back. Go ahead. I'll pass the mic, brother. I'm all here. Listen. So for a season. For a season. Potiphar was prosperous Mm -hmm. because of a prosperous man. Mm -hmm. It came to an end because of a loose wife who he Uh gave passes instead of dealing with her Mm -hmm. according to knowledge. Instead of putting boards of cedar around her Mm -hmm. and deal with her according to why you know you let her run loose Mm -hmm. on the field trip. Let her run loose. You gave her permission on the field trip. What you want to do? And he was not surprised. You know, you you know you, you got a son to act up. Man, we took your son on the field trip. Mm, mm, mm. He stole some Snickers. Mm, mm, mm. He hit somebody in the mouth, and he broke a window at a store. He did what? <laughs> Don't act surprised, you know, because that's what that—that's what that that's he his, do at the house. Up. That's his makeup. And you gave an undisciplined child permission to go on a field trip, knowing they don't know how to carry themselves. Oh, Potiphar knew his wife. This is why he didn't falsely execute a righteous man. Come on here. Because he knew his wife, and he knew Joseph, and the God of Joseph, the favor and the prosperity that was on that man's head. <laughs> and with that being said, he went ahead and just had him incarcerated. He had him incarcerated. Falsely accused, unrighteously incarcerated mm-hmm. for something the man he didn't do. And we've heard this story too many times, too many times. as black people. Come on here. Y'all, we, we just building rules. To the game. Come on, man. We ain't making nothing up, and we ain't throwing rocks, but we will stand on the truth of what we talking about. Come on. That story we just gave, those illustrations, he went for the family that prays, and then we went to Joseph and Potiphar, and we the subject matter is permission slip, giving a pass, <clears throat> and a passport. I, I want to go say a little something real quick. I want to nail this. Say something real quick. You have people who are not qualified for marriage because mm-hmm. they still hold on to perversions, mm. fetishes. Right. They have not established the truth. Right. One of the things that you look for in a grown woman mm. and a grown man is the truth that they walk in. Okay. And when you try to hold on to perversions, uh, fetishes, flags, brother. You start. We start. We start developing stuff like this. Penalties. A sister wife. Wow. Boy. We swingers. Mm, that, that's coming soon, y'all. We're we going to get that in there. Uh, the what They call them the, the add one. Mm. We add one to the bedroom. But they're trying to convince you, man, we, we are in a platonic, Boy. mutual, uh, loving relationship in the marriage, and they will try to convince you <laughs> that they wrong is right. 
Compromise. You know, you know, you know, to keep them when you talk about keeping fire in a relationship, you know, we gotta mm-hmm. keep, keep it spicy and everything. Keep it spicy. So I, I go get a, a, a Kim Kardashian wigs mm. and, 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 and we role play. And I ain't got no, I ain't got, 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 got nothing wrong. Play, husband and wife. Role we'll, play. Role playing until it crosses the line of scrimmage. Mm. You all size. Because when we talk about former things being passed away, mm-hmm. if they're not passed away, then they every still, time they I still saw them, they still form them. Mm-hmm. So when I see a woman, man, she got lips like him. Mm. Ooh, she walk like Teresa. Mm, mm, mm. Man, she got uh, hair like, like Lisa. Mm-hmm. And all these are mindsets and memories and spirits of the past. Cold so then moment. I'm in this marriage and I'm like, baby, won't you uh, rub my feet like this? Uh-oh. Why do you want me to do that? I, 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 just, I just want you to, but that's how Keys, that's how Kim mm, rubbed rub my feet. feet. Oh, watch out now. Baby, I want you to put on that strawberry dress and do this and go get some peanut butter and uh, some cucumbers and some ice. Well, well this cucumber ice come, just, baby, just, uh, but that's what I did with Teresa. Mm, come on now, build it. So I'm bringing in all these spirits from the spirits past. From the past. Then I think about that threesome I had with my partners. Uh oh. Baby, how would you feel? Mm. Sound like a menage. Uh-huh. But he got to set it up. Mm, mm, mm. Baby, do, do you think she's cute? Yeah, I think she's cute. Compromise. She, compromise. You think she got nice hips? Yeah, she got nice hips. Compromise. Then it, it get real slick. Have you kissed a girl before? Uh-oh. Ooh, get on in there. What that? What that? What's that, Katy Perry? Mm. I kissed a girl and I liked it. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, I did that. They, they sent you with these questions. I think, you know, I remember the one. Sent you with all of a sudden, you know, I, I just, I just, you know, I got a, I got this high tolerance of sex, baby, and I just, I just, I'm, I love you, but I'm just not satisfied. Mm-hmm. I really would be pleased if we brought an ad one to the bedroom. I don't, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. <laughs> but baby, you know, I don't know if we're going to make it such, such a, yeah, I just, we tried one more, one time. For for you know it. Compromise. Mm-hmm. Cop, the cost cop, for you know it. You you change the truth into a lie. Now we swing. Now we swing in Hollywood. Ho- Hollywood. Hollywood swing. That's what that do, brother. <laughs>